hands up! Have fun. I'm here for you, to help take the load off your shoulders. So, what's our next move, boss? That's easy enough. Are you okay? I'm fine. Here, this is for you. A flower? Can you bear to see the planet suffer, Cloud? is the gaming gestures here with a special Sony State of Play podcast episode. There are a lot of games out there that are We're going to be diving in here, talking all about Sony State of Play, and we're going to be pulling that up here just a second. You got your usual hosts here, Angrod and Shamrock. So, let me get the uh, Sony State of Play up here, and let's get let's dive into it. Right. Oh, you know what? That helps. There we go. Already, I like the little hint in the beginning that no one got, or no one was even expected for the ring. Hey, hey, do you hear that? So first up, we have... We have some Capcom, who, by the way, had a great year. Yeah, I can already tell, spoiler, what this is going to be. I can already tell by first being Capcom, two, by the way it looks, this is going to be a Monster Hunter World DLC coming out. Actually, I think it's a whole... Is it a whole game? I don't think it'd be a whole new game. They're still banking on Is Monster it? Hunter World. I don't know. I mean, I well, I don't know. I, mean, I haven't played Monster Hunter, so I can't really speak for. I mean, people love it. Oh yeah. I mean, it's I their number one selling game as of right now. I don't know. See what we got. Yeah. Yeah. I'm kind of intrigued a little bit. It's it looks good. I mean Yeah, Monster Hunter World was a really good game and this is definitely I'm live it's living up to the hype for this one, the little whatever Whatever they got going. We got we got a title. No, we got more <laughs> more of a video. <laughs> they got the bad on now. They're gonna show off more for it. I mean, so far it looks like it's a nice mix of cinematic and um, and gameplay, which is nice in a trailer. So many trailers don't ever have gameplay, so it's nice yeah. to see a little bit of gameplay. Yeah, it's bad when you're only watching the cinematics and then the gameplay is completely different than that. Yeah. What is that? But this one, you could at least tell the difference between the two, so... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, actually, somewhat... Game game graphics are actually as good as the cutscenes. Well, that's what I'm that. saying. Yeah, it looks amazing. So, so this yeah. is this Ice part Hunter. of the Monster World series, then. Yeah, the Monster Hunter World. So it's going to be a new DLC, Iceborne, coming out. Up, oh, wrecked by a boulder. So this is a DLC. So yep. not a new game. Here I'm like new game. Nah, I doubt. <laughs> it. It won't be a new game. Way too soon. They're not even done 
with uh, everything uh, they can do for S- September time. September sixth, unless we're British, then it comes out next month. But no, it's September sixth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, havoc! Is, havoc no havoc. Today we're keeping it short and sweet. The new look havoc. Some of the most anticipated yeah, one of the de- I guess they were one of the developers, or Check out Capcom's official I know I recognize. <laughs> Hmm. Okay, there's plenty more to, get to check out. This next game is a frantic take on dungeon crawling. Let's take a look. Dungeon crawling for the win. Okay, so it's kind of like a. This is a Sean game for sure. <laughs> this is a... Shoot and slash Shoot everything. Shoot and slash everything. <laughs> Ah, uh, see, this kind of sucks though. It's only couch. Is it only couch co-op? Four, oh yeah, four-player couch co-op. Well, that kind of ruins things. I like yeah. this couch co-op, but they really need online mode as well. Crossover skins. A. Okay, no guacamole. And Psychonauts. Shuffle and of course, Knight. who knows? No Shuffle Knight. And Enter the Good. So I guess these are some like indie darlings in this game, and they're kind of. Available is you, you put on that that skin and I guess you yeah huh so it's pretty much just a just a way to probably going to be microtransactions for a lot R- of them. River Riverbond Shovel Knight's in everything anymore yeah I thought he was um oh no wait he came to PlayStation I forgot about that now let's check out a new oh like terrible I like their setup. What was last played and up next? Sony Interactive. So far, not a whole lot to talk on. We could have done this in our usual podcast. That's fun, though. What is this? This This is Ghost Recon. No. (laughs) The fun part, trying to figure out what it is. (laughs) Right. Hmm. Like Jurassic Park? Invisible creatures? Predator! Hunting grounds! The hunt begins in 2020. Oh, Elphonic does that! Oh, good luck. Good luck. Elphonic was uh, part of the development the development team for Friday the 13th. Oh, uh-huh. so. So it was, it was Gun. I think Gun was the publisher and Phonic was or one of them, so it could go either way. Gun was the one under fire, so we'll see. Uh, I don't. was never really a big fan of. Um, you know, I, I've never played Medieval. So this is completely new to me. Like, it's one of those things that I think I. I might have had on the PS1, but I just never really... Yeah, I was never a big fan of it. Just never sucked me in. But for fans of... I mean, as far as a, 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 uh, I guess a remake, it looks good. Yeah. Like, I like seeing a lot of the old games get these updated graphics and looking like, you know, the best version they can look like. But I've you know, not having played the original, I can't really compare it to... Yeah, nothing to go based on. Would you believe that E3 is already next month? Yeah, and I was surprised because as I posted the schedule for E3 on our page, I was like, oh, and Sony's probably going to have a state of play and then... And here we are, state of play. <laughs> but it feels like we are just coming into 2019, and next month marks it's half over already. Oh, yeah. Like, it, it, I barely even feel like 2018 ended yet, and here we are halfway through 2019. Coming That's October. Not wait long to play it. Medieval returns this fall on PS4. It's nice that they at least now still have some games, games coming. Games hmm. coming. This game PS4. is Raccoon. A raccoon raccoon City. Raccoon City. I can see it. <laughs> I think it's a. I think it's like a, a squirrel. 
Is it a squirrel? Oh looks like a raccoon. Um, yeah, it maybe you're right. Oh, no, no, not a squirrel. Uh, not a meerkat. One of those glider things. It's like, like a flying squirrel of sorts, but I can't think of what they're called. Yeah. I can't think of what they're called. Is this... Is this the whole game? Yeah, you just pl you, you play as a parkour... You play as... You <laughs> challenge that snake. Parkour. So it looks like it's a... Uh, I want to say some sort of survival type thing going on. You have what it takes to Obviously, because your freaking whole entire habitat is burning. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Away the survival series. Fly away. The flying squirrel. Huh. It's got a zombie. Mm, probably not a game I'm going to pick up, but it's, it's interesting. Breaking it seems wall. like it, it would be like a an interesting like indie-ish title or something like one of those uh ea developed indie titles or something like along the lines of Fay or yes i don't think it'd be a state of unless are these all no they're not all sony developed games so i don't know well i mean some of them are exclusive i think and then uh maybe that could be I'm still hyped. The last state of play was still a really good one with No Man's Sky VR. That's when you finally got it. Did you pick that up yet? I did not. I'm working on it. Man, and it was on sale. Days of play. Exclusive PlayStation. Oh, yeah. Days of play. Up next. Oh. This was a short one. Oh, here we go. Get the sound up a little bit here. This is a game that needs no introduction. So, what's our next move, boss? What, once you see Cloud, you know what it is. <laughs> yeah, once you hear the iconic music that I'm going to play back in the beginning, that a little hint of what we were expecting. A flower? It looks so much different than the 2015 reveal, though, too. Like. It looks well graphic wise it looks i think it looks a little better the gameplay looks about the same they took the same fighting style they were planning changed it a little bit to see the planet definitely upscaled it though from what it was when they first well they went from obviously. an outside contractor to doing it themselves now so yeah they're really pushing hard for but are they really calling it remake though <laughs> oh yeah the final fantasy 7 remake Final Fantasy VII just... re-envisions one of the most beloved oh, games of all time. Oh, that's what it is. Look at the Resident Evil 2 remake. I know that's what it is, but I can't believe they're calling it that. <laughs> Look at Resident Evil 2 remake. Same thing. Well, that's a wrap on State of Play. have remake in the name. Store for you later this yeah. Year. Thanks for watching. But next we'll month, next they're going to, I guess that's going to be the highlight of Square Enix, because I don't know what else Square has got to show off at E3, so maybe yeah. they'll drop us a release date. Kind of what... Kind of what we're hoping, I guess. Yeah, I mean, oof. that was. I'm gonna go back to the very beginning, and I forgot I didn't have sound on. It happens. It happens. Hey. Go back farther. Oopsies. <whistles> All right. Today, I gotta right there. For people watching on YouTube, that little intro thing, that oh. was a sign of what's to come that probably no one even thought of what to expect. Oh, was that the Final Fantasy? Yeah. The little was that their thing? hint? Ah, uh, nice, their, nice. They snuck that in right when it started. and oof. But that wraps up our Stony, Sony State of Play here. So we're going to be live right after with our usual podcast here. Yeah.